Well, hi, this is Handmade House TV and I'm Noah Bradley. And today I've got a couple of interesting things to share with you. Stay tuned. Well, I hope all is well with you. I had a couple of things I just wanted to share with you this week on Handmade House TV. Uh, behind me uh, are two things that you might find of interest. Uh, one is this little uh, broken whirly gig uh, that I found on eBay for only, I was, think it was uh, less than ten dollars, probably closer to five, uh, and it's of an old man uh, still working with wood. And uh, when I saw it, I got a kick out of it. The reason why I was looking for it is because I, this is a lake property where there seems to be a constant little breeze. And I thought it'd be entertaining to have some kind of little whirly gig operation in order to keep me entertained. And this particular one popped up. And as you can see, it has no propeller on it. It doesn't work like it used to. And so I got a kick out of it being an old man that doesn't quite work as well as he used to. And so I thought it was a natural fit for the property. Uh, the other thing that I have behind me here is the first construction project that I had on my parcel of land. Uh, as you can see, it's nothing but a pile of stone. Uh, there's nothing meticulously laid by it at all. Uh, but nonetheless, I gathered 12 rocks that were unshapen and stacked them in a neat, pretty little stack uh, on my property. Uh, it's not in a greatly visible location. This is in a kind of a blind spot along my driveway. A lot of people wouldn't even notice it coming in and going out. Uh, but uh, I put it up there and uh, some people would refer to it as an altar to God. Uh, and uh, the purpose of that in today's world uh, is basically uh, whether the degree of religion that you might have or the type of religion you have, um, to me it's about the idea that when one enters their property to let the cares of that world fall away. Yeah, if there is a, pl a, sanct a sanctimonious place, a place of peace, a place where all of the trials and tribulations of the world uh, do not enter into your life, nor can they affect you, and that one enters such a, such a realm of peace with, with thankfulness, that they are thankful for the land they have and the place that they are. And so whenever I enter my property and uh, I've got bills to pay at home or somebody cut me off in my drive to get to my property, and I've got my share of stresses coming onto my land. Uh, I drive by this and I am reminded to let all of those things go and to have fun, to enjoy the property and to do your best to make it a place of peace and tranquility. Anyway, you might want to consider such a structure on your property. It doesn't cost anything. It doesn't take any time. And trust me, it's so worth it. Well, you guys take care.